Hey love bugs, it's Roz, I'm back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, much love to you and welcome to my returning subs, my grown extended beautiful family. Just thank you just for being you, just going down your path. Even though I know it's not easy, you're not giving up. You might take a break, but you're not giving up. You keep going towards that path of being a better you. And with that being said, much love to all. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light. And many blessings are definitely coming your way. And if you have um, have been watching my videos for a while and have not already, please, what are you waiting for? Like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell down at the bottom so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. And if you feel like you're comfortable enough, please go ahead and drop me a line or two. I'd love to get a chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. Or even if it's about the positive feedback of the content of my video. Or you're just up telling me about your impact the gift and how it impacted your life and heading you towards a positive direction and if your video um if the video has been very informative to you and you feel like you want to share and give good vibes please go ahead and do so and while you're at it give me a thumbs up like and even share on the social media favorites as well and once again thank you so much for stopping by my channel today and showing love and support and hope you're able to resonate with the content of my video Ooh, excuse me and the video I'm listening to today, sorry if there's some men on here, sorry, I, I accidentally pushed the wrong one, but it's very beautiful to me. It's called 432 Hertz, Healing Female Energy, Awakening the Goddess Within, Kundalini Rising, and Chakra Activation. So I will be posting that link in the description box below. Y'all, I'm still eating these, this fruit cup, fruit bowl, it's just so good. Um, my video I'm doing today is Twin Flame 101. Hey, Elkis, let your voice be heard. Let your voice be heard. You know, I really love doing what I do. You know, even though sometimes it can be draining, it can be overwhelming at times, it can be yet frustrating, but I love what I do. And it's just because when I was started on this journey, I was looking at a lot of different, um, motivational videos, you know, positive vibe videos, because I really wanted to see... How can I heal from all the things I was going through and how can I sit up here and make a contribution to the world in a positive way, be able to put a positive imprint on the world in a positive way. And it was just like amazing. Um, doing these videos, I was just like, like I said before, I started my videos of in search of finding my biological mother, searching for her, you know, wanting to know everything about my dad, even though there's bits and pieces that I know you know, from me and him communicating and things that I've learned along the way. But, you know, just learn more about my family. You know, if you're adopted, you know, you know that feeling of longing to want to know who, you know, who your family is, you know, um, what was the purpose for them giving you up? You know, I'm not mad at any of my family or, you know, my mother or my father, or anything for giving me up because my parents were very young. You know, my mom was 16 and my dad was 18. So, you know, they really didn't have a choice in the matter of really doing things the way they wanted to because they were young but it was just like the things that I went through in life that really traumatized me to the point where you know I knew I had to heal but I was just wondering was other people going through that and it was just like the outpouring responses of me starting to do my videos it's like at first it was kind of slow but things that I started gradually going through and started becoming to have a voice to getting that courage to start to talk to more people and be open because I always used to worry about what people thought what were they going to think of me if they're going to think of me as I'm crazy are they not going to believe the things that I say and it's just like some people don't believe what I say some people say oh you just talk too much and I'm just like uh this is a video you're not supposed to sit there and be quiet you're supposed to talk but you know I've had a lot of positive responses I mean I got some negative but it's not as bad as positive it's like I can put on one hand how many times I've had negative comments come towards me and it, it hasn't really been that many but it's just like even if they have they really haven't affected me in a way because it's just like I use that as a, a tool just like I use you know the positive stuff as a tool because you know the both of them give me that voice that even though if there there could be you know you know, corrective criticism, if I know I can do that, or if it's something I can really correct it, it's like, you know, no choice in matter, you know, I can't really do anything about that, but if there's things that I know, you know, y'all tell me about the things that, 
there are different techniques that you use. You know, if they stick out to me and stuff like that, or I read up on them, I'm like, oh, what's this? You know, I want to learn more about this then. And, you know, I may end up, you know, making a video about the stuff that y'all talk about. Or, you know, it, it's just more things that you find out more about yourself, finding that voice, you know, because there's always going to have some, you're going to always have somebody say something negative about you. Whether you know you're pushing something out, somebody's going to always say something about you, you know, but at least if you're still putting out something positive and you're being an activist for something, you're being, you know, a voice for something or you, you, you're a, a procreator of something, you know, and you're making a positive dent, give them something to talk about. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. If you're going to talk, give them something to talk about. And then, you know, maybe they'll get more people to bring you towards your way when they start talking about you. But have that voice for yourself. Don't let yourself be silenced for anything, for nobody. If you know if it's going to make you feel better, and it's not like to go out there and hurt somebody or be cruel to somebody. But if you're making a positive impact in your life as well as others, do it. Don't worry about what anybody says. Don't worry about what other people think. Because people will shit on you real quick when they figure out that they they couldn't get a hold of that idea before you did. So go ahead and keep doing what you need to do. Stay positive about yourself. Lift yourself up even when other people don't. And be proud of what you're doing because it took a lot of courage for you to do what you did. Have that voice and let it be heard. So I hope you are able to resonate with the content of my video. Y'all stay strong. I know y'all going through a lot of stuff right now. But we're going to get through this. We're going to get through it. Whatever you're going through, we're going to get through this. So send out as much love and light and positivity as you possibly can. Know you are blessed, highly favored, and truly loved. And knowing there's always somebody out there praying for your better days. And my post notification sh shout out today is to Thomas Roberts. Much love to you, fam. Thank you for hitting that notification bell and keeping up with the videos. It's greatly appreciated. And I hope your days stay blessed. And while y'all are at it, give me a thumbs up, like, and even share on your social media favorites. Social media favorites. Again, tongue tied today. Social media favorites. And drop me a line. I love a chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. Or, you know, just hit that notification bell and subscribe so you'll be able to know when I'm getting my, you know, uploading my next video. And I will see you on my next one. Peace. And be wild.